Today's job on the MOG is going to be the coolant system service. So, let's get to it. I'm going to drop the bottom, bottom hose off. Okay. It's not really supposed to be that colour. See that top hose is a bit newer. I'll do as a spare. It's an endless stream of rusty water, so I've stuck the hose pipe into the rad over here so I can get down that side of the rad and then I'll do that side. That was the final colour after the radiator flush, a little bit better. Now I'm going to try and flush the heater matrix in the cab. It's not working, so it could either be silted up, probably full of that brown horrible stuff, or the valve here might not be working. This is how you turn the heat on and off using this valve. Oh yeah. Lovely colour. Look at that. I flipped the hoses round, so I'm going to flush in the other direction now. You look at that. And we're back to dirty water again. That's looking pretty good. Let's move on to the block. My drain plug is completely bunged up in the block, which is apparently quite a common fault. Uh, so the other way to flush it is attach a hose to the water in there on the water pump and take a hose off of the thermostat, then run the car in idle until it gets hot enough to the thermostat to open and then flush it that way. So I've just taken this heater valve off. This basically sits on here on the block and it transfers hot water down through this pipe and then back or vice versa, I can't remember now. Anyway, it goes into the heater matrix in the cab. It's absolutely gunked up. So hopefully I can degunk it and this will start working again. Just needed a good clean out. 12 and a half mil drill bit fitted perfectly. And then I just blew it through with an airline. One hose I didn't bother replacing, which is that little tiny one there, and that's because it pretty much looks brand new, and I can tell by the fact the clips look new as well. Now to top up with some blue silicate-based coolant. Peter on Dragon's Den, destroying someone's invention. The guy invented something that allowed you to pour the bottle that way around, and uh, Peter just stood up and did this. Poor guy. been running at temperature for about five minutes now and there's no leaks yeah job done let's take it for a run <laughs> 